Epictetus was a Greek Stoic philosopher. He was born into slavery at Hierapolis, Phrygia and lived in Rome until his banishment, when he went to Nicopolis in northwestern Greece for the rest of his life. His teachings were written down and published by his pupil Arrian in his Discourses and Enchiridion. Let's know best quotes of Epictetus. We tell lies, yet it is easy to show that lying is immoral. The two powers which in my opinion constitute a wise man are those of bearing and forbearing. Freedom is the right to live as we wish. If virtue promises happiness, prosperity and peace, then progress in virtue as progress in each of these for to whatever point the perfection of anything brings us, progress is always an approach toward it. Whoever does not regard what he has as most ample wealth, is unhappy, though he be master of the world. No greater thing is created suddenly, any more than a bunch of grapes or a fig. If you tell me that you desire a fig, I answer you that there must be time. Let it first blossom, then bear fruit, then ripen. You may be always victorious if you will never enter into any contest where the issue does not wholly depend upon yourself. We should not move our ship with one anchor, or our life with one hope. It is not he who reviles or strikes you who insults you, but your opinion that these things are insulting. Do not seek to bring things to pass in accordance with your wishes, but wish for them as they are, and you will find them. Do not laugh much or often or unrestrainedly. If you desire to be good, begin by believing that you are wicked. One that desires to excel should endeavor in those things that are in themselves most excellent. Practice yourself, for heaven's sake in little things, and then proceed to greater. Control thy passions lest they take vengeance on thee. Neither should a ship rely on one small anchor, nor should life rest on a single hope. Silence is safer than speed. If you seek truth you will not seek victory by dishonorable means, and if you find truth you will become invincible. The essence of philosophy is that a man should so live that his happiness shall depend as little as possible on external things. It is not death or pain that is to be dreaded, but the fear of pain or death. No great thing is created suddenly. If thy brother wrongs thee, remember not so much his wrongdoing, but more than ever that he is thy brother. All philosophy lies in two words, sustain and abstain. If you wish to be a writer, write. If one oversteps the bounds of moderation, the greatest pleasure cease to please. If evil be spoken of you and it be true, correct yourself, if it be a lie, laugh at it. Difficulties are things that show a person what they are. Be careful to leave your sons well instructed rather than rich, for the hopes of the instructed are better than the wealth of the ignorant. First learn the meaning of what you say, and then speak. It is impossible to begin to learn that which one thinks one already knows. You are a little soul carrying around a corpse. To accuse others for one's own misfortunes is a sign of want of education. To accuse oneself shows that one's education has begun. To accuse neither oneself nor others shows that one's education is complete. Is freedom anything else than the right to live as we wish? Nothing else. Know, first, who you are, and then adorn yourself accordingly. Freedom is not procured by a full enjoyment of what is desired, but by controlling the desire. It takes more than just a good-looking body. You've got to have the heart and soul to go with it. Never in any case say I have lost such a thing, but I have returned it. Is your child dead? It is a return. Is your wife dead? It is a return. Are you deprived of your estate? Is not this also a return? Make the best use of what is in your power, 
and take the rest as it happens.